totally miss you. I miss you too. Food looks incredible. Yeah, now you did your thing with this. Uh, people make mistakes. It is what it is. They rectified it, but they did not. Imagine we'll both be lonely. <laughs> oh well, it's fine things to do. I like being on my own. Oh, yeah. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? It's a good thing. At least now you're leaving. I mean, yeah, I'm sad, yeah, but at the same time, I'm like, here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm back to being on my own. <laughs> What's new? Yeah. You know? But, um, as you said, you'll be doing virtual dates. Yeah, we're gonna do virtual dates. Because yeah. we're not. I mean, what's the time difference? One hour. That's okay, right? We'll wake up at the same time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so now we're gonna go take it to the airport. He's here, right? I think these are the cleaners. Good morning, guys. It's why do I look so crusty? I know I've just waking up. Um, I'm drinking my healthy shot. So bad, let me just down it. <clears throat> oh, damn. Imagine they came at 10. I want to say 10. It's 2 30. They're still nowhere near done, and I haven't had breakfast. I'm gonna to go to Slate's and have some food. I didn't think it was gonna take that long because I didn't want a deep, deep clean where they go through the wardrobes and stuff. Hopefully, I doubt they'll be done by the time I'm done. But anyway, I need them out by 4 30 latest because I have an appointment at 5. But um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys about it a little bit later because I did scratch my bathroom windows. So I'm a little upset about that too. I've decided to eat upstairs. So I've gone for the fish and chips. I was going to say, like, it's a red snapper. And then the chips, such as potato cubes. So let's get them. There's tartar sauce. Okay, so they fumigated the place. I'm going to go stay at my friend's house. But I'm just killing time. So I'm here at Troy's. I'm going to help him set up some lights. So let's do that. Myself out yesterday like a motherfucker. 
because this shit was ridiculous. Like I was, I just kept dropping them. But you can't do it on your own. No, I was trying to do. This is disgusting. Listen, it has no soap. You expect me to eat this shit? I use like pink Himalayan or black salt mm -hmm. or sea salt. Um, so I'm not a big salt person. I like to taste like the flavor of the food and the herbs. Um, next time I get a cold and shit, mm -hmm. I'll be like, I'm gonna call you and be like, yo, Give me some I need that some of that soup. chicken broth <laughs> to chicken soup, yo. Go hook a brother up, I'm sick. Mm -hmm. I will. I didn't even make it with chicken bones. Like, can you imagine with chicken bones? Mm. Mm. Oh, so you use like breasted chicken. Mm hmm Do you um, grill the chicken first? Mm-hmm. You know, I can see it's a little, on the outside you can tell it's grilled. Nice. This is beautiful. Thank okay. you. Yeah, now you did your thing with this. I don't do spice, but. <clears throat> I do spice. This is a little spicy. This isn't spicy at all. <clears throat> Yo, you did your thing on this. Thank you. I'm really digging. These are lights that we just put up. They look so cute. I just left Troy's. We had dinner. So yesterday I made chicken soup. And I made a lot. Planning on having some today. But obviously because my house getting fumigated, I couldn't have it there. So I had my dinner with Troy. We just had a little cat chunk because I haven't seen him since I think New Year's. Now I'm gonna go to my family's house because I still can't go home. I didn't know there was two. Someone else told me there's two. No, it's there. I, it's uh, that one. I know, it was meant to be. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm happy, man. If I get a job like this the whole day. Uh, I hey, pray that you get jobs like this the whole yeah, day today. To Good morning guys, it's the next day. I just come from my family's house and I'm on my way home. So the cleaning people, they're running late, which is okay because I'm running late too. It's 9.47. So hopefully I'll get there in the next 10 minutes. They should be there in the next 20 minutes. Get the floor mopped and then jump in the shower, get ready for the day. I'm really breaking out guys. I don't know where it's coming from. I'm not on my menstrual so I'm breaking out here. I, I've never broken out like this. This is really bad. It's gone down a little bit. Then I'm breaking out here, then I'm breaking out here. What's going on? Am I stressed? I don't know. So the cleaners, they just left. I could finally jump in the shower. So then he used a scrub, but it wasn't the right kind of scrub. So now it's all scratched. You can't see it from that side, but you see those marks? But it's like all over, there you go. So it's all scratched. 
So to be honest, I feel like I've lost more than I've gained with this cleaning service. Because that's going to annoy me now because I might have to replace it. invited me for lunch at this Indian place at the Surrey Centre. What is this place called exactly? Dabba? Dabba. 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 That's what it's called. Food looks incredible. Let me show you guys. So I went for the butter chicken. Then I got some veggie samosas. Um, I forgot all my French got. What did you get again? Uh, it's mushroom with some cashew nut gravy. Okay, and what did you get? Chicken tikka masala. So guys, just finished having lunch and now I'm getting my toenails removed. But I'm getting them removed and just probably redoing them tomorrow or the day after. if you can hear me but I just finished at the Surrey Centre lunch was so good I ate so much today First, ah! I just got stung by thorn but yeah I'm just on my way home now I got some cute flowers so I just got home from the Surrey Centre bought these cute flowers I hate the flower arrangements before I left, I made a cup of tea that I couldn't even drink. What a shame. What a shame, what a shame. A hubba or dubba? Whatever, that Indian restaurant. The food was 10 10, really lovely. Nice I had the butter chicken. And then, now that my house is all clean and fresh, I wanted to get some white roses. I got some white roses. So before I get changed, I'm gonna fix it. Um, I hate cutting the stems. I got two. I don't usually buy white roses. It's always red, pinkish. Where do I have last? Oh, red. Yeah, I want to switch it up. These ones, I get them from Fresh To Go or something, that grocery store. And um, yeah, they don't come with flower food, but I do have some. Even though last time I didn't use flower food and they did last me a long time, so I don't think I'll use flower food. Not right now, anyway. I think I might leave some leaves on them. A little bit shorter.
take a nap i'm tired okay, it's still the same day i took a nap washed off my makeup i feel so good so now i'm gonna go to sharky's to have some amazing goat soup <laughs> why my camera keeps doing this like i've realized it goes out of focus so often and it's kind of annoying and i only realize it when i'm editing but anyways guys how's everyone doing so it's a few days later now i have been sick imagine i've had food poisoning twice in the space of two weeks like yes i know i've got a very sensitive stomach but twice in the space of two weeks is a bit excessive um both times i've eaten out i know so I'm gonna stop eating out. Like I promised myself, I'm gonna stop eating out, just start cooking more at home. But I've just really lost my appetite. I know it might not seem like it because I'm always going out eating, but I promise you guys, I've really lost my appetite and I've lost a lot of weight. And that's without me even trying. So I wanna get my lean muscle back. I don't mind losing fat, but like my muscle that I've worked for so hard in the gym, no. So um, I went to the gym this morning, super proud of myself. I don't know why I'm like really struggling to find my momentum in the gym. Like I'll go, it's like very spotty. I'll go and then I'll start continuously. And it's been going on like this, like the start of the whole year. Um, so I picked it up this morning with like cardio. I went cycling for half an hour. I never go on the bike, but um, yeah, I sweated my ass off. It felt really good and I want to keep it up. But I really want to get my program because I have everything on my phone because I've been doing this like for six years ish. So I know what I'm doing in the gym, but it's just finding that discipline of waking up really early in the morning because I only work out in the mornings on an empty stomach. That's the only time I can work out unless it's just walking on a treadmill. I can do that anytime. So I haven't really been eating anything. And to be honest, I've got no grocery at home. Well, I do, but. It's like boring food, you know? I wanna make my food exciting because I've really also lost my mojo in the kitchen. Like I never really enjoyed cooking. Well, you know, when I lived at home, I did enjoy cooking. But the fact that this is so repetitive, having to cook every single day for myself is boring. And then I make very bland meals. I'm gonna try my best to start making creative um, meals and stuff. Um, hopefully that will encourage me to cook more and yeah I want to try eating three times a day because now forget the past two days but like before that I would eat twice if that so I want to start eating three times a day um, get my protein up because I haven't even been calculating my protein intake but I know it's been shit so I'm gonna do that so I'm gonna go to my favorite butchers buy some meats buy some chicken um i was thinking of going past the market but now i'm like i uh, can't really be bothered so i'll just get all my produce from um the supermarkets so let's do that guys yeah i've just been in a little slump you know um but alhamdulillah i feel so much better but to be honest with you guys i feel like the start of this whole year has been blur for me because it hasn't been a reset at all because mentally i haven't even tried to make it a reset or a refresh um i've just been going with the flow and it ain't flowing no more you know what i mean usually january is meant to be like a refresh a restart to the year but for me i've just been on the guy and i've been really distracted that the new year didn't even feel like a new year to me um which i kind of regret um, but it's fine we're still in january and i'm gonna make more of an effort to really just focus on myself and my goals and really get my mental health and my physical health in order because i've slacked so much um yeah i haven't journaled this whole year the gym like i said has been very spotty for me but i don't like to dwell on things so good energy good vibes and yeah let's get cracking it's the first thing first grocery store and yeah let's do that oh and also um so as you guys know i had my house cleaned um and honestly i wasn't gonna say anything i was gonna keep my mouth shut and i was gonna conceal their bad service but 
Because they happen again this morning, I'm like, no, because if anything, who am I doing a favor for? Am I really doing them a favor by concealing their errors? Or am I doing a disjustice to the people that are using their services? Because I don't want to promote something that I wouldn't use myself, you know what I mean? So initially I was contemplating whether to say something or not. And then I decided not to say something because I was like, you know what, uh, people make mistakes. It is what it is, they rectified it, but they did not. So this morning I woke up and I saw a baby cockroach and I promise you, if this was me this time last year, I probably would have had a meltdown. But because so much has been going on in my life, I saw this cockroach, I'm like, you know what? Let me put my big girl panties on and I grabbed the pink stuff spray and I sprayed it dead. But as you guys know, a couple of days ago, no, last week I had this cleaning service come round and the minute they came in, I saw a cockroach. He walked in the spare bedroom, the spare bedroom is pretty much empty. Um, so the minute he walked in there, I saw a cockroach, I'm like, what the actual fuck? You guys came in with cockroaches, so I told him to put all their stuff outside. And he picked up the cockroach and then flushed it down the toilet. So then, after they cleaned, they fumigated the place. So I'm like, you know what, you fucked up, you rectified it, it's fine, I'm just gonna keep my mouth shut. That wasn't the only thing they did, but I'm sure I've shown you guys, but they've also fucked up my bathroom window. But anyway, that was then. Why am I waking up this morning and I'm seeing the baby cockroach? So I was so upset, I called the lady, I was like, you know, it's unacceptable. And she was like, we can come tomorrow to fumigate again. I'm like, your fumigation clearly isn't effective. So now I'm even contemplating whether to use them again to fumigate the place. I'd rather just get the people in the building for them to fumigate the place. And um, I want nothing to do with them. Like, literally, all I wanted was, honestly, just my balcony cleaned and my windows cleaned. And then for them to cause so much chaos in my life, by just cleaning, I find it so ridiculous. And then for me to be promoting them in the sense of, oh yeah, they do great service. No, they do not. Their cleaning might be great, but fucking hell, who the hell wants the house cleaned with cockroaches? Not me. And <laughs> I just don't know what to make of it. So I'm gonna go speak to um, the guys downstairs and I'm gonna see if they can arrange something for me. But it's just such an inconvenience because even then, when they were cleaning my house, I couldn't stay at my house that night. And then it was like a whole two day process. And now a week later, I'm still in the same fucking predicament with cockroaches running around. Like, okay, granted it was one, but still if there's one, there's more, you know what I mean? So I'm really upset about that. Just don't know what to do. Anyway, I've said what I said. I'm never using their services again. And if you guys want to use their services, by all means, but I'm giving you a heads up. Because I just thought, you know, it would be so unfair of me to be promoting something that I would not use again and to top it off, to cause you more harm than good. Because I don't want to do disjustice to my followers. Um, and I know they're a pretty popular cleaning company. Maybe they're doing this deliberately to make sure you keep using them. I don't know what their end game is, but fucking hell, I am not using them again. That's for sure. Anyway, let's go grocery shopping. You know, there was a time that I used to like grocery shopping. Now I dread it. It's like one of the most tedious things ever. Anywho, let's get going. Watch me going out of the way when I should have went home. Only time of the day I get to spend on my own. I was tripping all high. I used to sleep at your crib. Should drive out right where you lived and pick you up on the way. We ain't spoken so long. Probably put me in the past. I can still get you wet and I can still make you laugh. You should call it. So I picked up the meats. I got some chicken and some chops. Now I'm gonna go to the search centre to go to Careful and do the grocery shopping. We have food plus here, but I'm just so used to shopping at Careful. So that's what I'm gonna go to next. Yes, I can still get you wet and I can still make you laugh. You should call in the work if that ain't too much to ask. I can pour you up a drink a week at first. Spoken so long, probably put me in the past. 
ass, I can still get you wet, and I can still still get you wet, and I can still make you laugh. You should call in the work if that ain't too much to ask. I could pour you up a drink a week at first. three or four it's eight o'clock what the hell have i been doing that's what i'm gonna know been out the whole day i'm starving um i'm gonna pray quickly and then let me quickly put the meat in the fridge because i'm scared it might go bad so i don't even want to cook anymore i'm not over it i don't want to cook they let on cook. What am I going to eat? I'm not going to order no takeout, so. Alright, meat, a chicken, meat, a chicken, meat, a chicken, meat, a chicken, meat, a chicken. Meat is quicker to cook than chicken for me. So I think I might go for meat. We'll have some lamb chops. Yes. I'll put the meat in the fridge. Uh, let me show you guys what I got. So I got lamb chops. I told them to wrap it two by two because there's no way that I'm eating more than two chops. And then I got these chicken, they're like pre-seasoned. They taste so good. But I still add my own seasoning on top. Delicious. And imagine guys, there is no um, bin bags anywhere. I think it's the second or third time it's been happening. Lack of bin bags. Anywho. I'm gonna go pray now. So I'm putting my groceries away and then I find this bag a bag full of potatoes these are not mine i don't even need potatoes i've got so much <laughs> this is going to be such a quick meal i need to sort this out it's such a mess um yes season 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 oh and i'm lucky because i have some leftover rice from yesterday so yay <laughs> I know some of you guys want to know how I season my chicken. I promise guys I will do a whole video on how I season my chicken. It's super easy. My stomach is still not 100% so I don't want to put too much seasoning in. So that's grilling. I've never tried this, but I'm not really in the mood right now. Ooh. And I never knew that they had coconut water. I'm gonna have some of this actually. way for this not to go bad because it always goes bad with me so i think i might cut it in half and put the other half in the freezer let's do that so here's my dinner guys it did not take me too long so lamb chops some leftover rice from yesterday um cucumbers and some grilled broccoli i'm gonna enjoy my food so good Good morning guys, it's the next day. So I've taken a shower and I've washed my hair. Curly hair is just so difficult to maintain. Um, I find it so much easier with my straight hair, but I don't want to straighten my hair anymore because the heat damage is unreal. It might not look like it from here, but you guys, the top is just straight strands. Um, so I'm gonna go get it braided and afterwards, 
I'm gonna go grab a correct chai from Biscotti. I don't know if I told you guys, Biscotti, they have this correct chai and I feel like they've actually nailed the correct chai compared to the chai wali in Westlands because I feel like they were just missing something. But these guys, it was so good. So I'm gonna go treat myself and then go see some family, come back home, get ready and go out and then, because the lady, I was meant to get my home fumigated today, again. Um, but I don't want them to come early because then I'm going to have to be at the house the whole day. Um, and the whole night. <clears throat> I don't have anywhere to go. So I'm going to see if they could just come um, early evening around 6pm. And then I could just like be out the door and just come back the next day. Um, How many hours left? <laughs> The, the normal one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah.